Congratulations Jeff, for all these years you have spent with us by investing $1,000 each in our mutual funds. Now as you know that with promise 20% return rate, we award you a check for $1,000 monthly. Out of which $200 will be given to you. The wait wasn't I supposed to get a 10% return? Yup 10% return with 3% bank fees and 5% taxes. So you get 2% of the money we promised you. You know that I have a house loan to pay and I was expecting your mutual funds to save me. Now, what am I supposed to do? Why not try our new mutual fund scheme that is designed for people like you? Wasn't it going to be the same thing? I will put again all money and will get hardly a piece of the return I was promised. Don't worry this time about these funds, no government taxes will be taken. So no no kind hidden charges to you. If you say so because I trust that you people are professionals and you know how to use my money. So there is a zero chance that I will lose all my savings and will broke when I stop getting my salary. After one hour. Congratulations Jeff, for all these years you have spent with us by investing $1000 each in our mutual funds. Now as you know that. Out of which $200 will be given to you. Wait a minute but it wasn't I was promised that I will get the full return that was promised to me? Now, what happened? Well, man, it was true that you would not get to pay any taxes in these funds but last year government passed a law demanding a 5% tax on these funds. So you know we don't make the rules. Now, what should I do now? I have only 10 years before my retirement. Please give me a good financial advice. In that case sir, I have the best offer for you. Start investing in our bank's new crash retirement funds which are made for people like you with only a few years away from retirement. 30% return rate and no taxes included. Well, you know that I don't have any financial education to deal with these steps. So yup if you say this I will trust with all my saving that I have left now and hope that this time I get my return. The reason we so many people going bankrupt. This is because they give all of their savings to someone they don't know, but consider them the expert. But in reality, they don't even know where to and how to invest. If you have the question of becoming dependable this way then the answer is, our education. Now I will not go into details about flaws and errors in the system. We have many great experts to tell this, my point is what are we taught? If you are given a financial statement of the company, can you understand it? So my whole point of the topic is not criticizing what you are learning, be a doctor or engineer, lawyer, all these professions are great when it comes to just having a salary. This is not a safe way to survive financially. What happens when you lose? Oh just shut up. I am tired of this narrator telling us in every video that we need financial education or else we are doomed. Come on we have a high paying job and retirement funds to support us. Seriously why should we trust this guy? I am in complete agreement with the doctor. I was a top position holder at my university and have a degree in LLB. I am the highly paid lawyer of my state. I have my financial advisors to support me. I don't need to worry about money. Thank God, I didn't listen to that idiot. I mean what he is saying is totally worthless. If learning about money was going to be important then wouldn't it have been taught to us in school? But we were not taught because it wasn't important. Hello boss, I hope that everything is fine. It's look like you are here to tell me good news about something like my promotion or bonus. You're fired. But why boss, why am I fired? Do you know that there was a patient who asked you if he having issues in his head? What did you do to him? Well as an experienced doctor, I just gave him an injection. Please come here sir. Well, the good thing about being a medical specialist is that you earn a lot of money. So much money that I have that I can easily survive my life on. You see that narrator? I won. Your thinking was wrong. Okay so what are going to do with your money? What else I am going to do? I will party and spend as much money as I can. I have enough money that I can survive forever. After one hour. Okay so, why sad face my friend? I thought that I had 2.5 million dollars in bank but I found out that after getting taxed at rate of 40%. Now I have only 1.5 million dollars left in my bank account. See that, my friend. Now you understand that why despite of having a good job, it is important to know such kind of things. Do I like an idiot to you? This was the best thing in my life. Now that with all the money government has taken from me, 
My money is not tax free, I can spend anywhere I want. And the tax that government took, they will repay me in form of pensions. Doesn't it look weird to you people spending their ta time and life and money like this? The money that they earn so much is just taken away in just minutes by the government in the names of the taxes. Yet they continue to believe that the government is going to support them with the tax they have taken by giving them the pensions and so. But what's the problem? Why these people are like this? Sadly, it is not that these for them fault. It is in these schools that they have been taught to live like this. Go to school, get the degree, then get the job, save the money and enjoy. That's why many people, despite of having a good degree, nice job, and high salaries, go broke. The money they give to financial brokers goes to waste when because of another crisis, the market loses its value. Now we are not going to waste your time further and will tell you the solution to all of this. The solution is. No solution. Not because it is unsolvable but because it is different for each of us. Be a doctor or engineer, lawyer. Because we all think, work and study differently. The same thing goes for financial education. One thing you can understand in this image. The rules of investing or earning is different. Investing in real estate and in mutual funds is different. The ways that can make you rich in real estate. will send you to jail when trying to apply for mutual funds. What can be the ways? Well my friend we call it rules in our dictionary. So how can you know the rules? By going to school. Brilliant. You will absolutely end up in jail. It is done by getting financial education. You can achieve financial education. On real estate. Cryptocurrency. Stock market. Fun part by understanding rules you can pay less taxes. Get more money. You can do it by going to seminars. Read books. But if you are lazy to do this stuff. Then don't worry business oversimplified is made for people like you and me. Just sit back and get some financial education to make money. On the viewer's request. In next video we present you steps to avoid tax.